And it's Nani Ali. 21. Now the counter. Number six. Well, it didn't look good for a while, but that was brave defending, and they got away with it. Yeah, they, they showed a vulnerability until the move was stifled. That stirred a little concern. Decent chance. And that is commitment to the cause. corner of the game. Ruben Diaz is there and he can get that clear. Oh, he's managed to pinch it off him. Well, they deserve an awful lot of credit for their commitment to the cause, but it's a goal credit that would be most welcome now. That will surely go down as one of the easiest goals he could ever score. Well, it doesn't have to look spectacular. Why complicate simplicity? Well, this is what we've been waiting for. I think the danger for... Can he finish? Well, oh, that is rather wayward. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Substitutions taking place. Portugal are making a change now. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it. I think that's happened in this case. Keep the ball, and you win the game. It really is that simple. It's a good ball, and he quickly tries a shot! like a preconceived plan. Win the ball and then unleash. So all square with almost no time remaining. Minutes has been indicated. Bruno Fernandes. Four added minutes on the board. Shifted on the field. Stop target. A more than decent attempt, Peter. <laughs> and that's it. Well, a game that had everything except a winner. Really watchable and honours even. And it is of note that not a single card was shown today to either side. Unusual indeed in this day and age. And a quick Sachin, how do you reflect on what we've seen?